In this video, we will be reviewing how to use menu item filters in Volante's reports. To begin, let's navigate to the reports function from our back office home screen. For the purposes of this demo, we're going to run a specific sales report without any menu items first, and then again with menu item filters turned on so we can compare the report results. Let's find it. Here's the sales report, grouped by categories, groups, and menu items. I'm going to run it for a time interval that I have some data for. Let's hit generate. Running the sales report without any filters shows me my entire menu. The report gives us sales data such as net quantity and net sales, and is a very detailed report. However, it is also quite a lengthy report and we may be looking to narrow down this report and save some time on the data we're looking for. We can use menu item filters to help with that. Let's go back to our reports. And this time, while we're selected on our group by categories, groups, and menu items report, we're going to step into the menu item filters tab to configure some settings. In this view, we can see our menu is once again organized into that familiar tree structure by divisions, groups, categories, and menu items, just like in our menu setup function. We can narrow down which data we want to report on specifically by making use of the checkboxes located on the left-hand side. We're going to expand into the Volante Burgers menu and look for a specific menu item we're interested in seeing sales data about. Let's say we were curious about how some of our beverages performed. Specifically, let's say I wanted to look at how my hot drink items performed. I can select the checkbox next to the hot drinks category. And if I expand out the hot drinks category, I can see that all my hot drinks are selected. Now let's generate our grouped by categories, groups, and menu items report again and see what having a menu item filter applied looks like. Let's hit generate. In the report that pops up, I can see my usual exhaustive list of menu items that we initially ran has specifically only reported on my hot drinks category and nothing else thanks to my menu item filter. Menu item filters allow us to filter which particular division, group, category, or even singular menu item we're interested in looking at within our report. Now, it's important to keep in mind that menu item filters do not work with all kinds of reports. Our sales reports are definitely compatible with menu item filters because of the data they show. However, if we try to apply a menu item filter to, let's say, a media collected report, we can see the menu item filter area is grayed out indicating to us that the menu item filter is not compatible with this kind of report. And that's okay and makes perfect sense. A media collected report gives us information about cash, debit, credit cards, etc. And trying to apply a menu item filter on it about hot drinks, for example, would expectedly not work. Menu item filters are very powerful when we want to look into the nitty gritty details of our menu to see which items are performing well or which items are performing poorly. They are also good for making comparative reports. And that's how menu item filters function in Volante's reports. Thank you for watching.